size of that chub. Oh my god, that could be a new PB. That is massive. Let's get him up now. Close look. Oh my god, that is big. Let's see. Alright guys, you won't believe it, the hook fell out in there as well. So I'm a lucky boy. Look at the size of this chub. I ain't weighed him yet, that will do. Oh, that is a beast. Oh, oh, oh. Proper chub, definitely four pounds. That's PB's 412, I'm hoping this will go close. What a fish, not a mark on it. I'm double bagging the side of up. Oh man, it's a tough day, but that's just made it really worthwhile. What a fish. Show you the other side quickly. There he is. A group of about four or five of them. Uh, it seems like the bait float just buried and bang. What a fish. Oh, I'm overjoyed with that. Aren't they amazing creatures? Beautiful colours as well. It's October sunshine. Beauty. Alright, let's get them scales out and weigh him. I'll let you know. Yes, I'm up to very chuffed and it's a beautiful fish. Releasing. Yeah, a three ounce roach, man. It's about, what, five ounce would be. Lovely red fin there. Uh, autumn sunshine. Nice fish. Yeah, it's a roach that one, I can tell. There's a lovely bunch of them out there again, but they are shy. But I've been really enjoying this afternoon, it's been really good. Hopefully, we can get a few more fish. You can see. Playing that fish, amazing bite again in this shallow water. And just a tiny, just a bit smaller than the last one. Three pound eleven. But absolute beauty. Well, not a mark on them. Same rig as last time. Double red maggot, size 20 or five pound line. Oh, I didn't get much better than that, does it? it? Took me a while to get um, a bit to take the bait that one. It took me a loads of casts, but last time it was second cast. But 
other side. Uh, two children, a few little roach. Pop thing, can't grumble a lot, can we? A lot of fish. Watch up. It's getting back in, eh? Resting this tube a little bit. Good fight of that. Uh, I was a bit worried about the wind with testing, but it's helped me out because I've, I've had an upstream wind, which has kept easy to make the line when he's got him, so I think he's ready now. Let's let him go away. Uh, off he goes. Super. Again, guys. Well. Keep, keep out after these other chubs if we can get a third one. Um, I've had some nice roach. Uh, another little chub about a pound. Didn't bother putting them on camera though. Battery's low now. I just had this lovely roach as well. Biggest I've had today. Ooh, come here. Matt over here. Nice fish. I don't know. 10 ounces. Beautiful fish. Uh, nice to get a nice roach out. That's a beauty. It's been a really good day, I've been right enjoyed it. Um, so I'll have another half an hour. Let's get him back in, eh? Beauty. Oh, I've got a naughty pike here. Only a little one. Well, probably smaller than the chub. Three and a half pound, maybe four. He's not very happy. Uh, well, I had a perch on, a beautiful perch. Must have been pound and a half, getting maybe two pounder. I had it on for ages and the two pike started following it in, I couldn't believe it. One of them was having having goes at it. And the perch was like fins up, trying to get away from the pike. And eventually the hook slipped. Luckily they left the perch alone. But it'd have been lovely to get it in. So I'm not happy with this pike. I think it was this one that was um, chasing the perch. I mean you couldn't even eat you couldn't even eat a two pound perch, could he? What was he thinking? Well a lovely fish. My first pike uh, of the autumn, so always welcome. Markings on that fish are amazing. But yeah, that perch, oh, I'll never forget it. I wish I had the footage of it, it was, it was unbelievable. Uh, I was getting back in anyway. Greedy pike. Well, I said there was two, that's his partner in crime. Lots more than the last one, maybe just touching three pound. Very aggressive, these fish. Smash the roach up. Uh, glad I brought my dead baits with me. What a little fish, though. Two bike. <laughs> Two little jacks. Not bad. Not bad end to the day. Let's get him back in.